one I'm going to explain about Bison and Moodle, the two platforms that you're going to use throughout your study here in Weimar. First off, I'm gonna start with Bison and how to access it. Just Google it, Bison Uni Weimar. It will appear on the first search result. And Bison is where you can get your timetable, information about your modules, how much credits you can get, register for exams, how to check your transcript or overall grades, and also download your enrollment certificates. For your login authentication details, it's the one that you got from the SSC. So for me, it's this one. And the password, of course, if you have changed it, then use the newer password. And I want to say that unfortunately, Bison is only available in German. However, for international students, there is a PDF manual that is available in English and you can download it here. And now we're gonna check your timetable. It's under Mein Student Gangplan. And here you can see it weekly and it is updated automatically, but you can also change it depending on the week that you want to specify here. It is for human computer interaction winter semester 2018. And I want to say that you can also know more about the modules that you are taking or you're supposed to take here. Just click on each of this link and you can get to know more about it, like how much credits you can get and also what are the pre-requirements here and what kind of exam or assignments they are giving. Yeah. And now we are going to the dashboard or the homepage and how to register for exam. It's under Prüfungsverwaltung. I hope I pronounced it correctly. So this one it's for when you want to check uh, the exams that you have registered or the exam that you have taken in the past. And this one is for the exams that you have cancelled. And this is very important is where you check your transcript or the total grades. And this is the explanation regarding the current exam circumstances. And this one is for last summer semester 2018. So obviously they are gonna update it during your exam later. Now go back to start site and how to get your enrollment certificate is under Studiumsverwaltung and here Studienbescheinigungen. You can download each of the enrollment certificates per semester as PDF file. So yes, that's Bison. Don't forget to log out and now we're going to move on to Moodle. Again, just Google it. Moodle Uni Weimar. So unlike Pison, Moodle is available in three languages, so German, English, and Spanish. For German students, there is video tutorial available here, so you can check that also. It's more detailed. And now we're gonna log in. But I want to tell you that Moodle has two login authentications actually for you. One that is registered under your private email account and one that is registered using your SSC or your official university authentication. And I suggest you to use the one that is official from the SSC or your university email account to log into Moodle and then to register for classes. Because, yeah, Moodle, it's uh, sometimes the professor will instead accept or filter requests within the Moodle instead of giving registration key in class. So when they see that you are using private email account, they may think that you are not a student from Weimar, so they will not accept your Moodle request. Oh yeah, and Moodle, it's where you can get your study materials like slides and also a list of literature references and where you can also upload your assignment and check your assignment grades, not your transcript, just your assignment grades. And if you are registered uh, for a Moodle 
um, study doesn't mean that you are going to take the exam. For an exam, you have to register in Bison. So you are only registered, like really, really registered if you're registered in Bison. <laughs> if you're registered in Moodle, you can still drop the course because Moodle is just for how you get this study materials. So for an example, I'm going to log in using my private account. Sometimes it might take a while to log in into Moodle, but it's okay, that's normal. And this is the team colors, you can change it, whatever you like it to be. This is the dashboard, this is where you check your notifications, the messages within Moodle, and this is where you change your profile, preferences, edit profile, change your privacy setting, and this is where you check your assignment grades. And this is uh, where the modules that you register for are. You can change it here. And for each of these module setup, they are different depending on the professor. Usually they will explain it to you throughout the class. But yeah, so each of this is different how they set it up. And yeah, you will enroll into courses from here also. You can search from here or look here. Yeah, Moodle is very easy. So, yes, that's it. Don't forget to log out.